West Pokot Governor Simon Kachapin has opposed calls to have the term of the transitional authority extended, saying the constitution is clear on term limits. He says the move will reduce the country's wage bill. Elsewhere, Lamu Governor Isa Timami has hit out at the National Land Commission for allegedly allocating 28,000 hectares of community land to the Lamu Port, South Sudan and Ethiopia Transport Project Lapset. The governor says despite the commission allocating huge swaths of land to Lapset, his administration is currently engaged in resettling many landless people. We are calling on the chairman of the National Land Commission and asking him that he should not proceed to allocate the land until and unless we have sat down as all the leaders of Lamu County uh, together with um, uh, other stakeholders including the Ministry of Land and also the Lapset Authority so that we can sit, deliberate and arrive at a, at a, a, a solution which is acceptable to all the parties. <laughs> A businesswoman based along Duruma Road in Nairobi is accusing some officials at the Nairobi County Government Inspectorate Department of engineering the demolition of her building located along Duruma Road. And Interior Cabinet Secretary Joseph Nkaiseri today inaugurated a new board of directors for the Betting Control and Licensing Board. BCLB. Nkaiseri challenged the board to reform the gaming industry in the country. The, the rate of corruption has gone up because the officers in the devolved government want more money for campaign 2017 and that's why they are coming up with funny laws, funny regulations so that people can fear and rush to sit hall and pay money which will be used for, 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 for corruption purposes instead of helping the Moana Inchi. We need sewer system is not there, we need water supply is not there, we need roads are not there but uh, money, money everywhere, fees everywhere, we are tired. In Kisumu County, traffic police officers mounted a major crackdown in Kisumu town. Several matatus were impounded for failing to meet transport licensing regulations. A similar exercise was carried out by the National and Transport Authority, NTSA, along Langata Road. Speaking during the exercise, the Deputy Director Safety Enforcement and Accident Investigation Colonel retired, Kared Aden, urged the Kenyans to use roads wisely and obey the laid-down regulations.